we're here today, it's the Salford Science Festival, it's part of the Manchester Science Festival. It's about engaging with the public and it's about uh, getting across some of our research about what we do, uh, getting in touch with kids, getting them hands on as well, doing exciting stuff, experiments. And we're here specifically to do seed bombing, which is creating uh, essentially a ball with seeds in it, uh, getting the kids hands on, getting them dirty, and learning about sustainability at the same time. It's about people, whether you're a student, whether you're an older person, whether you're a mum, a grandma, going out there, colonising space, beautifying it, creating productive landscapes as well, right in the heart of our city. So regenerating spaces with the community at the heart of the movement. Sea balls are pretty much resilient. They're very, they can pretty much survive on their own. Uh, and so they grow pretty much in even the harshest of environments. Do you want to make a seed ball? Pendleton is one of the only areas in which this has been encouraged. So the local authority is saying, come and do some drill gardening here. We want seed bombing. We want you to colonise this space. We want it to be a grassroots approach to sustainability, which is one of the first examples, not just in the UK, but anywhere in the world, where this has been encouraged and this is happening. So it's very forward thinking, very innovative. Um, and again, a really good case study of how other local authorities should be thinking as well.